mistake was Mr. Robert Schindler, and it was called, you can see there, which Chris Harrison. What you see is two orange balls to the left of the picture. And I've got strange origin, which are above the form and in front of the hedgerow. People have said that these lights happen to be carloads. This cannot be explained. Hedgerow behind, two orbs are above the corn, and one seems to be coming closer to the front of the picture, or closer to the screen, and the other is moving off to the right. Between them, there is uh, like white particles of dust or some sort. I believe that these orbs may have come out of and from the corn itself. This is the uh, picture of the blown up one of the left hand side. It seems a perfect sphere bright orange in the middle, yellowy orange, and an orange border. As you can see, the hedgerow right behind it, and above the corner. Photographs here, uh, times 100, uh, magnification. And this particular picture is nearly twice that again. This one is the right hand side, where as you can see, again, this one is above the corner, and in front of the hedgerow. Right. to the left, you can see the reaping the orb has come out of the corn. This picture represents uh, Chris Har Harrison. The definition of the picture, this is what this is to represent quality photograph was an enlargement, which this is a close up even further, times 500 magnification. So the quality of the pictures are poor in respect of quality, but they are to give some form of recollection of the picture. Here you can see on the left hand side the ghost of a figure of, of something or someone. So left the left picture there. Right, white wall in the middle of it. This again is unexplained. We don't know what this is, whether it's a blemish for the junction of the picture or a blemish of the negative. Here you can see another wall in the right. This one is a yellow colour and it's to the top left hand side of the photograph. This is at the edge on the edge of the photograph itself. Again, this one, we do not know what this is. So, uh, again, we don't know if this is a blemish or not. In this particular part of the picture, you can see the two white dust clouds and the two orbs to either side. And the definition of the hedgerow behind and the two walls above the corn. This is a close-up again, magnified nearly three to four hundred times that of the original photograph. This photograph, part of the photograph, is again unknown. Not sure what this is. It looks like I've. Uh, Um, a figure of some sort, ghostly figure, again unexplainable at the moment. Possibilities blemished within the uh, manufacture of the photograph or something of that era. I'm not too sure. This one is a, another close up shot of the orb that was on the left hand side, which is on the left hand side. Again, not too sure what this is. of the larger orb of the two that was in the picture. This is taken in the hedgerow of the picture and above the corn layer there you can see there's an orb in the centre of the screen and above it to the left you can 
see just another one of a different shape. And just to the right of that, there is a street. Whether this is a part of the photograph itself, we're not sure. This one also is an unexplained. Picture. This one is the of the ghostly pictures. And above the ghostly picture, you can see the ghostly figure. You can see there is a white spot just near the top right hand corner. Again, we're not sure whether this is a blemish in the photograph or a reduction in the photograph. This one also is unexplained. This one was taken a very, very, very close up picture of something in within the tree line, within the, the trees in the back of the picture, to the right of the main picture. Here you can see it up against the one from the bottom, above the corn, to the right, uh, to the left, sorry, there's the other orbs, and the extreme right is the picture that it was a close-up of. see the picture taken away from the uh, main picture, but only seen in a certain light.